No, I'm wearing a blue shirt, red pants, and I'm not wearing any. Oh, hey guys, what's going on? Crypto Samuel here, and today we're going to talk about the Coinbase killer. And that's going to be Robinhood. We're going to talk about why is the Coinbase killer and how you guys can go ahead and sign up. And for you new guys who are interested in getting into buying Bitcoin and holding it, or buying a couple other cryptocurrencies, why well, you need to stay away from Coinbase. Matter of fact, just run away from it. And here's why Coinbase sent this out to everybody. Everybody, about 15, 18 hours ago, and you guys can check this out, and here's what it says. It goes into saying, dear Coinbase customers, I like, I like this, you got to hold on. We're going to do it on the bass drop. Alright, there it is. Dear Coinbase customers, we're writing, we're writing because you have a credit card on file, we want to inform you, recent change that may increase the cost of purchasing digital currency with a credit card. Recently... The MCNC code for digital currency purchases was changed by a number of major credit card networks. The code will allow for the banks and card issues to charge additional cash advance fees. The fees are not charged or collected by Coinbase. These additional fees will show up as a separate line item on your credit card statement. Coinbase does not know whether or not your card issuer collects these fees. So pretty much you're telling us, for those of us who use Coinbase, and I know I did, I used a credit card because it was an instant transaction. However, it took it from like a um, five or eight percent fee to an automatic like ten percent, and then on top of that, to send anything, if you wanted to send like a hundred dollars worth of Bitcoin, it was charging you fifteen dollars, eighteen dollars. It was like a crazy amount of fees. So, all of us who use this instant transaction, which is what most of us do, you know, unless you're doing some huge amount, then you got to wait five days anyway. It's time to go. It's time to leave because we're over here on Robinhood, and the link will be in the description, guys. Robinhood. Let me see if I can pull up Robinhood's little message for you guys. And pretty much on Robinhood. I don't know if you guys know what Robinhood is. Robinhood is a um, stock exchange app, and it allows you to buy and sell stocks for free and to day trade and it locks you out after I think like uh, three or five trades a week so um, for those of you who are swing trading or holding this will be a good option uh, I was already on Robinhood and uh, during the summer and past couple of years I had been swing trading uh, some of my stocks from Robinhood before I really got into cryptocurrency in about September and then I just stopped altogether because the stock market's going up you know 10 15 percent uh, crypto does that daily so yeah <laughs> and the discussion right so here's what we're gonna see on uh, the Robinhood app we're gonna see Bitcoin Ethereum Ripple Bitcoin Cash Litecoin Quantum Ethereum Classic Neo Dash Bitcoin Gold Doge and a couple other ones that really look like acronyms that I can't uh, pronounce at this time off the top of my head. But anyway, this is a free stock trading app, zero fee, and now they're going to be trading Bitcoin. So for those of you guys getting your Bitcoin, this is a beautiful thing because you can get your Bitcoin from Robinhood for free. Send it, say, to your wallet where you're going to hold it or to the coin exchange where you're going to uh, swing trade it for free. So if it was $100 worth of Bitcoin and I was on Coinbase... And I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna pull this up for you guys and show you what I'm talking about. Say I wanted to send a uh, hundred dollars on Coinbase in Bitcoin, just a hundred dollars, you know, nothing big. So I could buy some um, <laughs> Ripple. Show you guys here. All right, so we're gonna say we're gonna buy a hundred dollars worth of Bitcoin, U.S. dollars. Alright, so here is an example. Right. Three hundred dollars worth of Bitcoin purchase when Bitcoin was fifteen fifteen thousand six hundred and there was a fee of eleven dollars. See if you guys can get that in there. There's an eleven dollar fee. 
That was the price of Bitcoin. There's the 300 right there, right? So there's that three four percent. Now let's go over to when we sent it, right? So let's say we're going to send the three hundred dollars in Bitcoin again. Oh, it's telling me I don't have enough to send it. So let's go back to my uh, previous transactions. Now a lot of us would just use transfer to uh, GDAX. That was like a loophole for a little while. I'm going to show you another one. Okay. So sending it to a Bitcoin address right here. The three hundred dollars, the same three hundred dollars, is now two hundred and eighty-eight dollars. So right off the bat, they took twelve dollars, and this is the same one being sent. You see two eighty-eight point three two. I, why would I send 288.32? I wouldn't. That doesn't make any sense. I would send everything I had, and that's what I did. So, guys, Robinhood. Robinhood, Robinhood, Robinhood. Until something better comes along, Robinhood. We do have Gemini out there right now. But for those of you who don't know anything about Robinhood, I'm going to walk you through how to sign up, and we're just going to sign up real quick. Um, so you just go ahead and hit the sign up. You guys can do this on your phone by downloading the little app, the little app. I'll show you what the app looks like. It is on Android and iOS. And I'm just going to show you what it looks like. It is like this little green uh, box with a quill. So that'll be the app. So when you sign up to get started, you can put your information in there. And it's a lot quicker, too, the confirmation. You guys are just going to go ahead, your name, email address, the username you want, your password. Your, uh, choose which you're going to be on, iOS or Android, uh, device, yes, no. And you guys can do this online. You don't need to do it on a, a phone if you don't want to. And then after that, you'll go into your basic info, your identity, again, which is even easier than it was with Coinbase, and Gemini, and the funding system. You could use a card or you could use a bank account. And then you just hit submit. Now, after you do all of that, guys, you guys do need to understand something. It'll I'll let you go ahead and start trading stocks immediately, start transferring money. And if you guys use my link in the description, you will get one free stock. It is random. It could be anything from um, Apple, Ford, Google, all the way down to uh, something small. So you guys could do that, signing up with my description. That way we'll both get a benefit out of that. That is an affiliate link. And let me sign in for you guys. Alright, so Robinhood Web is not up yet, but you guys can still sign up with it and get the early access, so just sign up. And the same way I just signed up for that, you guys are going to see the same thing on your phone. Let me see if I can pull that up for you real quick. But that's how to get to Robinhood. So I'm going to go to my phone, I'm going to get the Robinhood app out. And download the app because once you're on your phone, you can uh, get into it immediately. And you can put a pin in. I've got a pin in. All right, so there it is. It's telling me not to sleep. Right. It says fund your account so I can put some money in there to start trading with. And again, you guys don't have to put anything in there right now. Fund your account. And on the bottom, it says don't sleep. You see that? 
and it says get Robinhood crypto so you'll click on that little bottom and it says right there it says you're on the list I am one million one hundred thirty four thousand five hundred and eighty four in line so that is this the screenshot it is Bitcoin and that is where you are on the list after you guys get in tells you you're on the list and that is your affiliate link right there so you can invite friends so they can get in too and so on and it's that easy and I actually just hit the invite friends and invited somebody and again with this you can go to live ticker 24 hour one week one minute and the cool thing about this is it, it looks a lot sleeker than um, I want to say it's sleeker than uh, Blockfolio you know not to not to throw any hate out there about block, Blockfolio I do like Blockfolio um, and so now when I go clip cryptocurrencies under the cryptocurrency watch list I will click on cryptocurrencies click on BTC uh, click that click on the watch list Got Bitcoin right. as you can see here is my watch list up underneath it for some other things I was watching when I was day trading back in the day some for pennies on the dollar some for a couple dollars and there's Bitcoin under cryptocurrencies and then you'd be able to click on this and add you know how you want to watch it percentage change total gains loss last price and so on so within with time you'll be able to just hit that and just go ahead and and uh, search so let me go up here I'm gonna search and use the search bar I'm gonna type in uh, ethereum there it is ethereum came right up you guys see that ethereum classic and then you'll hit that little plus button you saw on the side so I'll plus that now watching ethereum And that's it. I just hit that plus button, and now I'm watching. It turns into a little check, and then I'll go back, scroll back down to the watch list. Now I got Ethereum, and I got Bitcoin. That's it, guys. That's all you got to do. Uh, Ethereum is back up to a thousand. I can see here that Bitcoin is at currently at the live. It's at uh, nine thousand eighteen dollars. It's the ticking back and forth from 50 cents to 30 cents ethereum watching that live too it's at 1000 so I mean that's really good considering the fact that ethereum is holding a thousand mark while Bitcoin is down a lot another dip so that's pretty that's some pretty good stuff going on right there and I'll add a couple more into those are the ones I really like uh, let's do uh, Bitcoin cash And I actually put in the abbreviation for the Ethereum. I just put ETH and it came right up. So, I mean, you guys type it in. So, like, for this one, I'm going to type in Bitcoin Cash. Um, I actually typed the whole thing. Oh, came right up. BCH. Now watching. So, that's it. And I'm not even in there yet, so I can't even purchase or sell or trade, but I can still watch. So, immediately after downloading it, you guys can go ahead and watch it. You can set your alerts on the app um, until your turn on the list comes up and then you can move on and do something else. So guys, this is why it's definitely going to be the Coinbase killer. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to put this video under the how-to section because I believe it, it's more so based on how-to. As always, guys, like and subscribe. If you like what you see, feel free to donate to the channel at the bottom. Help the channel out. Um, let me know what you thought about that new intro video. I hope you guys like that. And as always, guys, follow me on social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. And for those of you who are just getting started and would like help or would like one-on-one -on -one help and would like me to help you set up your portfolio, here's my disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. Invest at your own risk and only invest which you are willing to lose. But the Patreon page link is down at the bottom. 
and that with cool rewards will tell you how I can 